Bart D. Ehrman's book, God's Problem, How the Bible Fails to Answer Our Most Important Question, Why We Suffer, is a thought-provoking exploration of the age-old question of human suffering and the Bible's attempts to address it. Through a critical examination of biblical texts and theological concepts, Berman challenges traditional religious interpretations and offers a compelling argument for the inadequacy of the Bible in providing satisfactory answers to the profound question of suffering. Berman begins his book by acknowledging his own journey from devout Christianity to agnosticism, a transition largely fueled by his struggle to reconcile the existence of suffering with the traditional Christian understanding of an all-powerful and benevolent God. He emphasizes that this is a question that has plagued humanity for millennia, and the Bible, as a foundational text for many religious traditions, is often turned to for answers. One of Ehrman's central arguments is that the Bible itself presents a wide range of conflicting perspectives on the nature and causes of suffering. He highlights the diversity of voices within the biblical text, from the wisdom literature of Ecclesiastes and Job to the more traditional narratives found in the Old and New Testaments. This diversity, Ehrman contends, reflects the complex and evolving nature of theological thought within the biblical tradition. Ehrman delves into specific biblical passages, such as the book of Job, to illustrate his point. Job, a righteous man, experiences immense suffering, and his friends offer various explanations for his plight, including the idea that suffering is a punishment for sin. However, Ehrman argues that the book ultimately rejects these simplistic answers and portrays God as mysterious and inscrutable, challenging conventional notions of divine justice. Furthermore, Ehrman examines the New Testament's treatment of suffering, particularly in the context of Jesus' crucifixion. While Christian theology often interprets Jesus' suffering and death as a redemptive act, Ehrman questions whether this interpretation adequately addresses the broader issue of human suffering. He argues that viewing suffering solely through the lens of redemption can be limiting and fails to provide a comprehensive explanation for the suffering of countless individuals throughout history. Throughout the book, Ehrman also critiques the Odyssey, the philosophical attempt to reconcile the existence of a loving God with the existence of suffering. He argues that theodicies, including the free will defense and the idea that suffering is a necessary part of a greater divine plan, are ultimately unsatisfactory and do not adequately address the depth of human suffering. Ehrman's analysis extends beyond the biblical text to examine historical and cultural contexts. He discusses the impact of Greco-Roman philosophy on early Christian thought and the development of theodicies within the Christian tradition. He also explores how various historical events, such as the Holocaust and natural disasters, challenge traditional theological explanations for suffering. In conclusion, Bart D. Ehrman's God's Problem is a compelling literary analysis that explores the Bible's treatment of the question of suffering. Ehrman skillfully highlights the complexity and diversity of biblical perspectives on this issue, ultimately arguing that the Bible falls short in providing satisfactory answers to the profound question of why we suffer. Through critical examination and thoughtful reflection, Ehrman challenges traditional religious interpretations and invites readers to grapple with the enduring mystery of human suffering. His work serves as an important contribution to the ongoing dialogue surrounding faith, suffering, and theodicy.